Hey everybody, it, it is I, Mr. Skids, and welcome to Uncanny Valley, where I will be playing a Let's Play, believe it or not. How do you play a Let's Play? I don't know. But I do know that this is like the fifth time I've had to do this because of complications. Um, I told people that I would be doing Let's Plays again, and here I am doing Let's Plays again. So let's hope that we can actually get this done. So let's get into the game, okay? Let, I haven't played this already. Uh, that continue button is baloney because I haven't, con haven't started playing this game yet. Uh, WASD for movement, sprint to shift, E to interact, space to pick up items, advanced dialogue, F for flashlight, control, uh, E, R is for my gun. Now, I've seen this game, inventory is I, I have seen the, um, the, what's the word, uh, demo for this game. Press I to open inventory, click on the item selected, plus... Left click to use the item, right click to just deselect it. Left click to use the item, right, okay, okay. Uh, I drag and drop the bandage on the damaged body part, okay. Press control to ready weapon, and press E to fire. R to reload, okay. A lot, you're throwing a lot of shit at me right at the beginning of the game, but okay. We, we'll try to remember all that. So, I don't have a gun yet, because I just tried to press it. Well, how did I get here, says Mr. Tom. Let's see. Get on the bicycle. I want to ride my bicycle. I want to ride my bike. I could push that dumpster to climb over the fence. But I like living fence cutters. That's convenient. Oh, oh, I get choices. I get choices. Now, I forgot to mention this. In the beginning of the game, it says all my choices, all of my choices will matter. Like, every choice, it's like a butterfly effect. Every choice I make in this game changes the outcome of the game. Now, a lot of games, you know, do do that. But, uh, apparently you have to play this game a couple times through... To kind of get the feel of what happens in the game. You know, you're actually supposed to play it a couple times through. Okay, that's not what I... What was that? What was that all... I like my crouching ability. Okay, that's how you crouch. I'm gonna get you. I'm like a... I'm like, um... I'm like the hunchback of Notre Dame. Look at him. I'm gonna get ya. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that is hilarious. Okay, so do I want to cut? Do I want to cut the fence, or do I want to hop over it? Hopping over it would mean I wouldn't be able to come back here, and I might need to come back here. In all honesty, so maybe it is best if I cut the fence. Maybe it was a good idea. Maybe it was a bad idea. We will soon find out. We will soon find out. And if I have to, I could probably... Whoops, that's not what I wanted. There you go. I could probably block that hole if I needed to. Because this is a horror game after all. Oh, Ooh, it's dark. Ooh. Let's go to the left. What, what, what? I live nearby. I should get home. Live nearby? Where do you live nearby, man? How far? How close? It's nearby. Why? I can't sprint. I'm out of sprint juice. Oh, no. No, 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 no. There's the door. There's the door to it. They won't give up. I need to get to my room. Uh, uh, uh. Up, up, up. Um, 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 um. The elevator's here. Uh, let's go, 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 go. No, that's not my room. My room? Nope, no, nope, 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 nope. My room? Oh, fuck. Fuck a duck. They're right behind me, dude! Dude! Oh, shit, fuck me. Get in. Oh, no, 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 shit. Oh, shit, no. Oh, ow! No! Uh, mum, 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 mum. In the door, in the door, in the door, in the door! Help, help! Oh. 
And I died. Game over. Or is it? Ah, I, I, I'm having night terrors again, and apparently I'm tra talking to myself. Great. <laughs> no, you're talking to me, the player, don't you know? Ooh, sound effects. Boom, clunk, 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 clunk. Ooh, and the clunks are louder when I'm running. Oh, look, down below, there's, oh. Uh... But what's el what else is on the, the train? Um, I guess I get off. Oh, I guess for like a giant city with, you know, tons of people, a deserted uh, train station is a very normal. Yes, very normal indeed. Also, uh, can I go back down? Oh, I can't go back down. Oh, no, I can't go back down. Sorry. I kind of wanted to read the sign up there. Um, S. Woods Uptown Lake H. S. Woods Steely Groove Da Bridge. Da Bridge. <laughs> That's, you want to go to Da... Do you want to go to Da Bridge? To Da Bridge? Do you want to go to Da Bridge? Uh, Rose B. Uh, S. Woods. And, yeah. The Da Bridge one was pretty cool. And funny. Ooh, is there anything here? Ooh, can I take anything? No, 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 there's nothing here to take. Janitor's Anarchy Man, MTC, that homeless guy. <laughs> I, I want to go see a movie called That Homeless Guy. I'd go see a movie like that. Oh my god, dude, you need to lose some weight. Uh, there's a thing called cardio, cardio exercise. Uh, probably this guy probably can run better than me. I I instantly get winded. Hey, you must be the new guy, Tom, right? Nice to meet you. I guess let's get to the car. It's fucking freezing. Hey, watch your language. Okay, that was fast. Nice to meet you too. Nope, no car for me. Okay, never mind. I guess I have no choice. Get in the car. So, how's work? Great. I can sit on my ass, your fat ass, all day without anyone monitor monitoring me. So you didn't run into any trouble so far? Look around, man. We're completely isolated. There's no nobody here. Nothing bad will happen. Nah. Nah. So why do you need the security? Guards? Well, hell, if I know, just be glad you're getting paid. Oh, fuck. Come on! You so, I missed dialogue. Here we are. Wow. Jeez, containing yourself. Oh, before I forget this, path through the woods leads to the apartments. Right. This place is really something, though. Yeah, those bastards spent a buttload of money for this place. How come they shut it down? Hell, if I know some lawsuit or something, I don't really care. What are they going to do with it? Uh, you sure are curious. Maybe we could make the the speech bubbles just a wee bit bigger. I, 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 just, just my ramblings, my thoughts. But maybe make, make the speech bubbles bigger so I'm not, like, cutting off with my mind here. Until then, we got to sit around and get paid for it. Let's go in. Okay. Because it, it messes with my brain. I think that's the end of the sentence, and it's not. Also, I can barely fucking run because I don't do enough cardio. I, I about run as about as fast as lo and long as this guy here. I need to work on my fucking muscles, man. This is the main hall. Stay behind me. Come on in. in I guess. Come on in. Follow behind Mr. Jolly over here. I should have checked the time. Whoops, I didn't check the time. Oh, I know. I Never mind. I got time. I got time. Hey, hey, can can I? Okay. Okay, let's have a quick look uh, around. Follow me. Come on. Can I go in the security office? Can I get my gun? This is the main elevator. With it, you can access every floor in this sector. You need to make a couple of rounds up there, up there each night just to satisfy our boss. 
Nothing actually happens. Yeah, nah, nah, nothing happens. Nah, nah, nah. Nothing ever happens in a horror game. Another elevator. It leads to the lower section. This one is locked tight, and only the best employees had access to it. No need to pr patrol there. The door ahead leads to the warehouse. So this door? Oh man, can't go in that door. <sighs> Slah, come on! I'm I'm like 250 pounds, and I can run more than this guy. I'm ha I'm not like super fat, but I'm not skinny either, and I can still run more than this guy. What the hell? Okay, this is your workstation, the security office. Let's. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. My bad. This is it. There's a couple of cameras set up here, set up in this place. But like I said, you need to make rounds each night. Now, go to your room in the apartment building and get your gear in the closet. Here are the keys to the facility. After that, come straight back here. Your shift starts immediately. Go on, leave me alone. Well, that's freaking really, really rude. Are you serious? You're a, you fat bastard. You, you, that's what he looks like. He looks like Fat Bastard from um, from the uh, Spy sh Who Shagged Me movie. Look at him! Oh my god, he I've never seen a more worthless pile than this guy. I don't like this guy. I don't like this guy at all. See, I don't mind... I Like I said, I'm large, okay? I don't mind big people. This guy just seems like a lazy lout. And that's one of the things I don't like, is laziness. Okay, go through the, the forest. Oh my god. Creepiness factor turned up to 15. I hope there's no skeletons following behind me. No chubby little skeletons full of puns. Ha 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 ha. If only. If only. What if I keep going? What if I keep going? Can that Does that work? I should really hurry up. And change. I'll be able to explore later. Okay, there is more to that location, so okay. At least I know. I forgot. Oh, I don't have the wire cutters. I have a flashlight. I have key cards. I have tapes. A notepad. Let me take a look at that notepad. Objectives. Those are some really good objectives. You are really planning for your future, huh, buddy? I have no key cards and I have no tapes. Okay. Good to know. Can I turn on my flashlight? No. Condominium apartments. Hmm, that's like saying apartment apartments. This is apartment apartments. Would you like to have a room at apartment apartments? Oh, scary lady at the end of the hall. Oh, hi. I didn't realize Buck, uh, Buck and I had company. I'm the new security guard, Tom. Nice to meet you. I apologize if I startled you. I'm Eve. So, what do you do here? I take care of the place, keep it from falling apart. Why would they need this place clean? There's nobody here but us. You sure like asking questions, don't you? You sure like asking questions, don't you? Yeah, I've been getting that a lot lately. Look, I'm sorry, but I have to leave now. I'm, I prepared a room for you. It's on the first floor, seventh room on the left. You'll find the uniform and the gear in the closet. I don't want to keep you go go uh, go ahead. Nice meeting you. <laughs> okay, lady. Can I talk to you again? No, I can't. I forget how to do the controls. Please, you're gonna have to like re-educate me, game, because I already forgot my controls. Into the elevator. Oh hey! Oh hey! Oh, that sounds real pleasant. My ears! Okay, uh... Nah, I didn't think so. Nah. 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 Yay! Okay, here is my tiny ass room, but it's nice! I would live here. Oh, I'm in uniform! I'm not slacking on my first night on the job. I am not slacking on my first night of the job. Oh, did it get darker? Oh yeah, that's like police action right there. That's how, if you ever, there's a difference when uh, like police hold their flashlights. 
Uh, if you probably know this already, but police officers always hold their flashlights like this. That way, um, they it's kind of like a, a weapon in that form that when you have it like this, you can easily just smack somebody upside down. I don't know. That's just my ramblings of stupidity, but I think that's how it, I think that's one of the reasons why they hold the flashlight like this is so that if somebody gets you know a little bit too frisky or stupid, boop, boop, right in the head with the back of their giant flashlight. That's really heavy, might I add. Oops, I somehow rode the elevator to the same floor that I was on. Okay, ground floor. Help! Ring the bells! The bell tolls for thee. Oh, I had a dining room, huh? Ooh, turn on my flashlight! Woo, woo, woo! Woo, woo! Who goes there? Who's that? Who's that? Uh, nobody. Nobody. Oh! Can I take that? Can I take that? Can I pick? I can take it! I took the fire extinguisher for some. some reason. I guess I'm not only the patrolman, but the fireman of the place as well. Uh, Fire Marshal Corey! Fire Marshal Corey here! Can't tell you something! Somebody will- nobody will get that reference. Nobody. No, ever, I'm, I feel like I'm saying- uh, speaking my age when I do that. Let me tell you something! That's a fire hazard right there and there. Where am I? Ah, that's what the flashlight's for. Who would have guessed? Um, I, it took me a long time to change. It's awfully dark over here. Okay, this way. Let's go back to our job. Steadily going through the absolute creepy forest. I would pr I hope to God nothing tries to creep up on me. Except for maybe funny smiling skeletons that have... Uh, spaghetti. Spaghetti ready for me to eat. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha. Here we go. Oh, that echoing. Ooh, I like that. Ooh. The music's good too, might I add. The music is very good. Um. Let's see now. What's in the boys' bathroom? Anything? Nobody taking a dump in here? How about anybody take a piss? I'm, go I'm on patrol. I gotta make sure you're having a nice, healthy dump. Anybody in the women's bathroom? Oh, flickery lights. Creepy. I can't, I don't think I can interact with these doors, so. Oh well. I don't think so, at least. I tried. Hey, Tubbs McGee is gone. Tubby, where'd you go, friend? Look at this fucking mess. He just fucking candy wrappers and bags of chips and shit everywhere. What a disgusting pig he is. Ugh. Again, I'm not making fun of him for his weight. He needs to scare you guys to open this. Okay. Again, I am not making fun of his weight. I am making fun of his horrible hygiene and horrible laziness, in all honesty. Oh man, I think uh, I better. I gotta cut this real short soon, because uh, time is running up. And let us get down to the lower levels first before I cut this episode. Uh, oh, there's tons of floors here too. Uh, let's is this is the ground floor, so let's go to floor one, I think. Ooh, okay. Uh, what is in here? Okay, there's sound equipment. So this is a recording studio of some sort? That's what it looks like to me. And you know what? I'm gonna check one more room. I'm gonna go across the way here and check this room and then I'm gonna call it. Okay. Uh, oh, I interacted with this thing. Uh, from Damien to Adam. Uh, subject. RE archiving archiving. Yeah, no problem, madam. I'll bring it over tomorrow. Just make sure you got two TBS of HDD space, terabytes of high def uh, hard drive space ready for everything. Uh kayak hailing done quicker. Whoop see hey. Can we resume that? Oh, oh 
Okay. All right. Uh, let's. Oh man. So let me just read. Um, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Something ain't right here. Something ain't right. The screen is a little. <laughs> it's a. It's a holographic screen. It, it, it's a new technology. It's like a projection screen. It projects outwards just a little bit. That's what's going on here. Uh, from Nigel to Jonathan. Indexing. Hey, Damien. We wrote some new algorithms for voice re reproduction and recognition. The phrasing is much better now, and the flow is much more natural. We'll be sending you the stuff in about an hour. If you could be so kind and update the database. Thanks. Oh, God damn it. I keep pressing escape to get out of this, but it's not escape. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that there was nothing I missed on that one. I don't know why I'm reading the computers, but I am. Okay. James, from James to Anna. Um, subject, uh, response to kinda creepy. Yeah, I know, it's, it surprised me too when we got the first one running. It knows who we are because of the staff database. I'm having trouble believing it myself. I have let, a lot of people are going to have their lives improved because of the thingamabobs. Thingamabobs, that's a word I would use, man. We just started working on their vital sign recognition and me medical scanning equipment. Oh my, there is some something. I'm guessing something to do with... Ah, my shift is over. I need to get some sleep. What? I haven't even... I haven't even... Uh, uh, God damn it. Ah! Ah, uh, ah! Uh, I haven't even really started exploring this place yet. I, I haven't even just got. I haven't even finished floor one. You telling me that you're already done? Ah! I spent five minutes on my shift. I'm done. I'm tired. I got. I gotta go to bed. Oh, what the fuck is wrong with you, dude? Do you have like sleep apnea or something? It's like 3 a.m. Your shit. When did I get here? Like nine or something? Wait, how did that, that, how much did, oh, how much time did pass? Like, how did that go by so fast? That's insane. Well, that gives me a good reason to, um, oh, let me out of this fucking darkness. It gives me a good reason to say, or end the, end the night, like, end this episode, but still, what the hell? Like, I had just finished reading those messages and stuff, and whoop. See Daisy, uh, and I'm already. It's already over. Now I gotta go back to bed. Can I go to floor one, please? Ah, I gotta run all the way across the hall. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Uh, ah, fudge, nutters. I thought I could interact with the um, the thing there. Okay. The wall, the the jacket on the wall. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh goody! No, 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 no. We're gonna save this nightmare for the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed my first playthrough in a long time. I uh, hope you enjoying Canny Valley so far, and I will hopefully be able to load up the next episode tomorrow. Also, I just noticed it's pouring outside. Good, good. Okay. So, thank you guys for ta tuning in, and hopefully I will see you next time. Take care. Bye. <laughs>